Yeah. Hey, I got Tim McCullough here. This is another one of our seniors that's getting ready to go ahead and finish up his career here at UTEP. Uh, I'm going to ask you the same thing I asked Jeremy right. and Quentin. How'd you get here oh, to man. UTEP? Scholarship. Oh, man, uh, some other things didn't work out, you know, uh, with other colleges or whatever. You know, came up on a trip. You know, had some friends up here. And I just came. You know, um, I was I went to a JC called Cerritos College in Cerritos. So, you know, my time here was fun. You know, didn't work out like how I wanted to. You know, messed up my knee and stuff. So, you know, hopefully the future has some better hope. You know, for me. You know, at the next level or you know. So, hopefully, if not, you know, I'm graduating December. So, that's the best thing. You're hitting. Now you're hitting you know? all the questions I want to ask. And what's your major, Tim? Um, just general studies. General studies. General you're graduating studies, yeah. in December, though. December. Yep. What's in the future for you? Um, hopefully, you know, I can get into maybe like the Canadian League or mm -hmm. the new American League that they're, you know, that's taking over the Canadian League. Right. You know, if not that, then, you know, um, I'm going to probably work as a, at the Juvenile Detention Center. So, you know, um, I got, got a backup plan. Your, your degree is general studies, but you're, you're kind of leaning towards criminal justice? Yeah. Uh, okay. My degree is general studies, and I have a minor in criminal justice. Right, excellent. Okay. So, yeah. All right. Um, you're graduating. You had some problems with the the leg, yeah. And I know that you're just still kind of working through that, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. Uh, it's getting better. Getting better, but it's know. not perfect. It's not back to where it's supposed to be yet. Yeah, you know, it's not a hundred percent, but it's better than it was before. And it has got to be painful for that to have happened to you this yeah. year, because this was the year that you. We're primed to come out and make yep. your statement yep. and get ready for the future. Yep. Yeah, so. But if you're physically healthy, we know you can play. Yeah. And that's all you need is a shot, huh? Yep. All that's right. all I need is a shot. No, so, so we go ahead and keep our fingers crossed. We yep. go ahead and keep our fingers crossed that you go ahead and do well with your shot. Yeah. Have you uh, had any scouts looking? Nah, not. It's a matter of going ahead and trying out. Yep. you got to go audition for a job, yep. huh? So. But you're not going ahead and doing it on a wing and a prayer. Yeah. You've got a plan. Yep. If it doesn't work, you say you're going to probably go ahead and work at the juvenile detention center. Yep. Now, which one? Um, so wherever I can get in at. Or um. Now, my, you see, you see the reason why I asked that question the way I asked it, because I'm wondering how has El Paso been to you? Um, you know, it's, it's been good. You know, it's not like back home. You know, I miss home. You know, um, but, you know, there's a lot of things back at home where I don't want to go back to. Mm -hmm. But, you know, like my family and everything's there. So, That's true, too. Um, you know, I'm thinking about just, you know, getting started here, then maybe going back home. So, you know, that's a... But you're not against going ahead and getting started here in El Paso. No. It's been a good enough experience here in El yeah. Paso that you wouldn't mind going ahead and staying here. Uh -huh. But eventually, family's family, yeah. huh? Yeah. Yeah. So. No girlfriend? Yeah, I do. She's here? She's here. She's a local girl. No. She's no? from California. Too. She's from California and yep. she's come here with you. Yep. How does she like it here? Um, it's like the same, you know. About the same? Yeah. She's willing to put up with you and stay here for a yeah. while, but she'd like to get back <laughs> to California too? Yeah, she would. Yeah. 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 All right. So. Well, I was raised in California and I know California holds a, a real allure. There's a lot to do in California. Yes, a lot. El Paso, I love El Paso, but I'm an old man and yeah. I think El Paso is more, <laughs> more for old folks, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, so All right. I mean, they got good people here, though. Well, it's good people, but it's just not exactly the most jumping place yeah. in the world, is it? No. Nah. <laughs> no beach. Well, actually, we got the beach. We just don't have the ocean. Yep, don't got the water. <laughs> All right. So. Thanks a bunch, a bunch, Tim. Are you going to go ahead and uh, you're going to be ready? You're ready and you're you're going to be playing uh, um, Southern Miss? Yeah, hopefully, you know, they got me in uh, nickel and dime, so I don't know if I'm going to be playing corner that much, but, okay. you know, got to make the best of it. So. Timing is is a bitch. Yeah, <laughs> you it know, is. it really it can is. be. A, you know, it, one day it can be the can be roses. The next yep. day it's oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So. Hey, personally, I want to thank you for coming to UTEP. Yeah, no problem. This this program was in a world of hurt. Yeah. And you command came over here, and you played a role. Yeah. And getting this place turned around. Yeah. I thank you very no much problem. personally. I thank you. No